coming! Yeah! Mr. 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 Ryan's music. So glad you came. What a wonderful day. Mr. 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 Ryan's music. Let's sing and play. We hope you stay a while. Macarena, she'll be coming round the mountain when she come. Yeehaw, she'll be coming round the mountain when she come. Woo, she'll be coming round. Whoa, whoa there, Barnaby. I think we've been followed. Wow, I see the wee tots. Well, I reckon. What's that, Barnaby? Oh, wow, Barnaby, Lice is down in the well with the pizza man? Wow, that's crazy. Oh, that's not right, Barnaby. Oh, what time is it? Well, I think it's time. I think it's doing good, Tom Tarn. I don't know what I just said, but it's time to start Mr. Ron's show. <laughs> oh, hey, guys, we're back. Whoa, hey, look at this horse. His name's Barnaby. Wow, look at this hat. Oh. Look at Pink Bear. She's wearing a hat too. Hey, Pink Bear. It's a special day because we got our hats on. Our cowboy hats and cowgirl hats and cow pink hats. And boom! Whoa, Barnaby. Okay, I gotta put Barnaby in his, his corral. He's getting a little crazy because he's so hungry. Whoa, whoa, Barnaby, don't eat the light. Oh, Barnaby. All right, guys, let's get started. Let's sing the morning song. Oh, man, I love wearing a cowboy hat. Let's see. Good morning, children. Good morning, Mr. Ryan. Oh, man. Remember I have a horse? Ha! We were horsing around. Oh, ha, ha. oh, wait. Let's say good morning to our horse, Barnaby. Good morning, children. Good morning, Barnaby. Oh man, Barnaby loves to eat. He doesn't just like pizza. Let's feed him something else. Oh man, open up your peanut butter. Throw in your pickle. Put in your chocolate ice cream. And we're gonna feed Barnaby. Yeah, let's go. Peanut butter, pickles, chocolate, ice cream. Oh, oh. Mm, I love any kind of food. Barnaby! Barnaby ate all the pickles! Oh man. It's okay, Barnaby. We're gonna feed you something else. It's healthy. Pancakes and cereal, bananas and apples. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> What's that, Barnaby? Oh man, he wants more syrup. Huh. You're such a sweet tooth, Barnaby. Oh man. Sometimes I feed him carrots. Oh man, guys, that was so cool. Now I really want to sing a song with you guys that we can sing together. That's about our country and it's about this land. But if I'm gonna go out on this land, I need to ride a horse outside. You hear that, Barnaby? Yeah, we're gonna sing a song called This Land Is Your Land. Howdy doody rooty time. Wow, y'all made it out here. And you got my new horse right here. His name is Jumpy. But wait a minute, where's Barnaby? Oh, there you are, Barnaby. Oh, Pink Bear's riding Barnaby. Hey, kids, you want to ride out there yonder across this land with me? This land is your land. This land is my land. California to the New York Island from the Redwood Forest to the Gulf Stream waters this land was made for you and me as I was walking that ribbon of highway I saw a Pink 
land Whoa. This land is pink land It's full of pink bears They sleep in pink beds And sit on pink chairs They comb their pink hair After drinking their pink tea This land was made for you, Pink Bear, and me. Oh, 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 howdy do to Rudy. You hear that, Pink Bear? This land is made for you, Pink Bear, and me. Oh, oh, you too, Jumpy. Oh, was that Jumpy? Oh, guys, there's more animals out there. Follow me inside. We got to go sing to the other farm animals. Whoa! Oh, guys, we are riding all the way across the land. I think I'm saddle sore. What does that mean? Oh no, ask your mom. Hey, remember, we're gonna sing a song to our animals. Let me show you all my animals. Oh man, they're all here. They're hanging out. Oh, cool. It's a song about a farm. Why it's called Old Mickey Mouse. I mean, I mean, Old McDonald. Can you guys sing that song with me? Say old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on this farm he had a, oh, is that a cat? He had a cat with a meow meow here and a meow meow there, here a meow, there a meow, everywhere a meow meow, old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on this farm he had a, oh man, it's like just a tiny little puppy dog. What does a dog say? Woof? Yeah. Come on, guys. With a woof, woof here and a woof, woof there. Here a woof, there a woof. Everywhere a woof, woof. Old McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Oh, guys, it's a horse. Oh, Barnaby, it's your friend. <laughs> hey, let's say nay. Nay to the horse. With a nay, nay here and a nay, nay there. Here an A, there an A, everywhere an A, A. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on this farm he had a... Oh, guys, that pig is crossing his legs and he's pink. Pink bear, it's a pink pig. Oh, ho, ho. what does a pig say? Hmm. Oink? Yeah, with an oink, oink here and an oink, oink there. Here an oink, there an oink, everywhere an oink, oink. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. On this farm he had a... Oh, whoa, it's a huge cow, but it's got horns. Oh, man, it's spooky. All right, just say moo to this cow. With a moo moo here and a moo moo there. Here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo moo. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O, and on this farm he had a, it's a chicken. You have to say, buck, 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 buck. He had a chicken. E-I-E-I-O, with a buck, buck here and a buck, buck there. Here a buck, there a buck, everywhere a buck, a buck, a old McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Oh, guys, you're so crazy. Oh, man, you never even say anything to me. Oh, guys. Hola, Mr. Ryan. <gasps> oh. Hola, niños. Hola, animales. Hola, my astronauti. Como estas? Very good. Muy bien. All right. Yeah, y tengo un regalo para ti. I have a gift for you. Oh, wow. A gift. Is it my birthday? My cumpleaños? Feliz cumpleaños a ti. I'm drinking some tea. <laughs> oh, no. It's not my birthday, oh. Natty. Can I open it? Sí, claro que sí. ¿Puedo abrir? All right, here I go. Whoa, guys. <laughs> Look, it's an Enye. Oh, Natty, how do you know I love this? I totally forgot to sing the Enye the last time I saw sing the Abe Seis. Oh, you're the best. But Natty, I want to show you something. Oh, I've got some animals. Look at this one. It's called a dog. Oh, en español es un perro. Oh, oh, you hear that perro? Nati, we say woo, woo, woo. En español, los perros hacen wow, wow, wow. Oh, oh, perro. Wow, wow, wow. He said, oh, wow, wow, wow. <laughs> All right. Um, 
Oh, Natty, look at this one. Oh, oh. man. It's just like a little baby chicken. <laughs> en español es pollito. Oh, pollito. Oh, we say. Bark, 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 bark. Los pollitos en español dicen pío, pío, pío. Oh, pío, 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 pío. Oh. <gasps> Whoa, there's so many little peos. Muchos, muchos pollitos. Whoa. Los pollitos dicen pío, pío, pío. Cuando tienen hambre, cuando tienen frío. La gallina busca el maíz, el trigo. Les de la comida. Y les presta abrigo. Bajo sus dos alas, acurrucaditos, mueven los pollitos hasta el otro día. Cuando se despiertan, dicen mamacita, tengo mucha hambre, quiero lombricitas. That was so cool. Did you guys see the peos and the dinosaur and the heart and the face? Yeah, that was cool. I love these little peos. Oh, pollitos. Oh. Hey, but sometimes I like to see real ones, real chickens, real pollitos. And my sister in Oregon has a bunch on her farm. Let's go check them out. Poop. Oh, poop. Oh, man, those things are cute. They're going pio, 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 pio. Hey, speaking of something cute, my good friend Isla Mia came over, sat on my tricycle, and sang Los Pollitos to me. Oh. <laughs> Nati, can we hear her sing? Sí. Vamos a escuchar. El pollito pía, 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 pía. Cuando tiene hambre, cuando tiene trillo, cuando cuta tala, a con un canillo, le da la comida, a ñoña, y te da frío. A con cuta tala, a con un canillo, le da la comida, a con tu frío. He's love you. He's love you. Oh, we love it. That was so beautiful. Bring, bring, bring. Adios, Nati. Bring, bring, bring. Adios. Bring, 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 bring. Hola. Hola. Oh, yeah. I was just taking my Spanish class. It was awesome. We saw little pollitos that said pio, pio, pio. Oh, yeah, I totally ate pizza pizza, man. Yeah, man. All right. Oh, wait, hold on, what? Oh, it's time for Education Station. Oh! It's time for Education Station. How do we know what we don't know? I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. Think about that. Oh, howdy doody. Oh, look at you, Mr. Brown Bear. Yeah, we're gonna learn some something here. You're gonna dumb learn yourself. Oh, are you ready? All right, all right kids, welcome to Education Station. Today we're gonna use my special keyboard. We're gonna learn about intervals. That's when I play two notes at the same time. Here's my first interval, ready? <coughs> oh, oh, my ear. Yeah, that one's really close. Right here from C to C sharp. They're right next to each other. They're called a the minor second. Here, ready? Ah! Oh, that's dissonant. Raw. Okay, now we gotta do one more. One, two. Oh, but it skips over the black one. It's called a major second. Ah! Well, that one's dissonant, but not as much as the minor second. Now, oh. You hear that, Bushy? We got a minor third. Just like our minor chords, this one's a little sad. Oh, 
Oh man, lullaby. And then major third. One, two, three. We say it's a third. Here we go. Oh yeah, that one sounds good. But then there's a perfect interval. What's that, Mushy? Nothing's perfect? Yeah, well, this one's perfect. Okay, perfect. Here we go. Whoa! I know that song. Here comes the bride. Do, 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 do. That's a perfect interval. And we got one more perfect interval. Yeah, Mushy, those things are perfect, okay? All right. This one is a perfect fifth. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa! Whoa! Oh man, I love my intervals. <laughs> This show is brought to you by cows. Hmm. Hey, did you like the music? Hmm? Oh, don't have a cow. Ah! All right. Oh, man. Oh, look at my seed song. Just having so much fun. Oh, hey, guys, just making some flowers. So they're out of this world. Oh, they're so cool. Oh. Oh, Pink Bear, you're playing with flowers. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Remember when we had a show and tell? Well, about flowers. And actually, that show and tell's happening right now. Oh, Addie, that flower is beautiful. Bodie, you really did a good job. I can see you're spelling your name. Corinne, uh, I love the stickers. Oh, Gigi, you made a face with your flowers. Isla Mia, you did a whole scene. That's amazing. Hero, you sent yours all the way from Colombia. Wow. Luciana, you sent yours from Montreal. Man, that's cool. Mila, you're Bodhi's little sister. You did a great job with your colors. Guys. Oh man, your flowers are so cool. I love it. Uh. Whoa, Pink Bear, what are you doing? Are you drawing a pink bear? No, uh, is that a pig? Oh, it's a pink pig. Hey guys, I think for next show and tell, Pink Bear wants us to draw an animal, one from the farm. Or, I mean, if you have a stuffy that you love that looks like a farm animal, send us a picture of it. I don't know, it'd be so cool. Oh. Speaking of cool, well, speaking of uncool, come here guys, I gotta tell you something. Oh man, I just never really talked to T-Rex today. He's feeling a little emotional. Are you okay? <laughs> oh, oh T-Rex, oh man, I'm sorry man. Usually we talk all the time, but today I'm gonna read him a story. Don't you worry T-Rex, I'm gonna read you a story. A story that you're really gonna like. It's about dinosaurs, okay? All right guys, let's go. Story time. Hey guys, you made it for story time. You too, T-Rex. I picked out a book just for you. It's called Curious George and the Dinosaur, because you're a dinosaur. All right, let's get started. Oh, it's a bus. Jimmy's class was taking a field trip to a museum, and George was going along. Well, glad to have you, George said Mr. Chauncey, the teacher, but don't get into trouble. You hear that, T-Rex? You might get into trouble. At the museum, Mr. Chauncey began to explain. One of the displays, he said, these rocks are millions of years old, and the students weren't listening. That's not good. This is boring, said a student. Sure is, said another. When's lunchtime, asked a third. Oh, T-Rex, they're hungry. They probably want pizza. Oh, man. George wandered off. He didn't find the rocks very interesting either. Yeah, didn't rock. But in the next room, George saw something very interesting. It was a huge skeleton with a long tail. It was too much for George to resist. He stepped over the rope and jumped onto the tail. Oh no, George. He climbed down and he climbed up. He climbed up and up 
until he reached the skeleton's head. Oh, T-Rex, he's on the head. Just then, Mr. Chauncey and the class came into the room. Look, it's a dinosaur, said Jimmy. And look, at George, he shouted. Rat him, George, cried a girl. Oh, you hear that, Barnaby? He's riding him like a horse. <laughs> the guards heard the noise. Get down from there, they ordered. Oh, I'm going to get the director, said the other. Uh-oh, T-Rex, the director's coming. George was scared. Oh. Is that how they rode dinosaurs in the old days? A girl asked Mr. Chauncey. Well, no, he said. Tell us more about the dinosaurs, someone said. George was curious. What's a dinosaur? T-Rex, they don't know about you. <laughs> well, said Mr. Chauncey, the earth was once full of huge creatures like this. Whoa. Suddenly, the director of the museum came charging in. What's this about a monkey on our dinosaur, he asked. Guards, get that monkey down before he causes any damage, he ordered. I think he's mad, T-Rex. Poor George. There he was on top of the dinosaur and no place to hide. Oh. Just a moment, said Mr. Chauncey. George was a great help to me. He got the children interested in dinosaurs. Yeah, T-Rex, you guys are interesting. We wouldn't have listened, said a boy. It's so interesting, said another. I want to come back again, said a girl. Well, said the director, I can see that our dinosaur isn't damaged. We'll forgive him this time. Oh, Pink Bear, you hear that? It's going to be okay. Oh. You can come down, George, he called. Oh, look at him. Hooray, the students shouted. Mr. Chauncey said, I have to thank you for making a visit an interesting one, George. But next time, promise not to ride the dinosaur. Yeah, Barnaby, you can only ride horses, not dinosaurs. Well, when the bus stopped in front of George's house, the man in the yellow hat was waiting. Oh, I'm glad to see you, George, he said. I hope you kept out of trouble today. Oh, man, what do you think, T-Rex? There's a lot of monkeying around. <laughs> oh, hey guys, thanks for hanging out during story time. Pew, 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 Wait a minute, guys. That's not the P.O.P.O. P.O. song. That's a goodbye song. Oh, no. Hey, guys, don't worry. Next Friday, we're going to come back. We've got an interview with a good friend of mine. Actually, he's a kid, and he can sing. Real kid. Oh, man. Kid's rad. All right. But we do have to say goodbye. Let's say goodbye to Barnaby. Oh, Barnaby. I really like Barnaby. Oh, man, a jumping horse. Oh, man. Yeah, let's say goodbye to Barnaby. Goodbye, children. Oh, yeah, music time is done. Now we're going to sing goodbye to Barnaby. Ready? Goodbye, Barnaby. Oh, yeah, music time is done. Hey, let's say goodbye to the P.O.P.O.s. <laughs> Pio, 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 pio. Goodbye, pio, pio. Oh yeah, music time is done. Pio. <laughs> oh guys, hope you liked the show. And if you did, go to the bottom of our webpage and you can donate. We're people powered. Yeah, you guys help us with every episode. And if you miss a show, bummer. Well, don't worry, it's on YouTube, and you can watch it like one million times! Ah, oh, yeah! Woo!